race is on for businesses to win new licenses to run duty-free shops in the capital Seoul, with the deadline for applications ending on Monday. Two licenses will be handed out to large companies and one to mid-sized firm when the Korea Customs Service announces the final results in July. Now, so far, seven large firms and eight mid-sized businesses are on the in on the bidding. The government body said it will consider several qualifications, including management ability, efforts to grow with other local firms, and commitment to social contribution. Experts predict operating a new duty-free shop in the capital will provide companies with an annual average of 898 million U.S. dollars in sales and 89 million dollars in profit.